Hey guys, because I didn't post a tutorial of the last style I did, I decided to bring you a very similar style today. I'm starting with a five day old wash and go that I stretched using the banding method. After removing all the bands, I love to just fluff out my hair a little bit. I'm sectioning off this top portion of my hair because we're gonna do a pompadour later. Don't worry about this part being straight. No one's gonna see it anyway. My hair was so dry, I had to bring out the big guns. Don't worry guys, it's just water and aloe vera juice. There was so much product already in my hair, so this mixture just added more. I decided to switch to my water bottle with just plain water in it. That way I'm just activating all the product that's already in there instead of adding more product. I split the rest of my hair in half, then I did a light finger detangling. You might not get all of the knots out, but you don't want to have a lot of hidden tangles in the center of your head. This is also a good time to remove all of those shed hairs that you shed over the past few days. It's Mommy. It's MJ. Good morning. Hi. Now's the time to add your gel or whatever edge taming product you use. I like to use a bristle brush to brush that in. Now I'm going to secure my hair with side combs. Now remember, you don't want to put the combs in this way. Turn it around and push the combs forward. These combs are not going anywhere when you put them in this way. I didn't want to add a third comb this close to my nape, so I just twisted my hair and added a bobby pin to secure that hair in place. Now you're going to do the same thing to the other side. Add your taming product, brush it in, add your side combs, and then twist the bottom and pin it in place. Now the mohawk in the back is done and we can focus on the top pompadour. I spray on a little bit of water just to dampen it just a little bit. And then I'm going to add my coconut oil to give it a little bit of moisture and shine. After finger detangling my hair, I decided to do a tension method blowout on this top portion. I wanted my hair to be really smooth and stretched and this made the process much easier. I split my hair in two and I started by loosely doing a two strand twist. You want to keep it really loose at the roots and then you can get a little bit tighter as you go up towards the end. I brought the end of the twist down, pinned it in place, and I shaped the pompadour to a look that was flattering for my face and my head shape. So this will look different for everyone. After I said goodnight to my baby cake, some friends and I went down to the Woodlands, which is a suburb area around Houston. We decided to go to a restaurant called Jasper's, which is amazing. This view of everything, and look, there's even horses walking down the street, only in Texas, right? So we decided to sit on the patio because we were going for happy hour and this place is awesome. They even have happy hour on Saturdays and not many places do that. My sister set up this really cute girls night out for us. She made us these really cute gift bags. Here's the menu, $5 for drinks and $5 for their appetizers. You can't beat that. As a table, we ended up tasting probably like two or three of everything and everything was delicious. Thanks to my awesome sister, we each left with some drinks and a beautiful compact mirror. Once we left the restaurant, we went to the park and we listened to Zydeco music for the rest of the night. Oh, this time, 
Thank you so much for watching and I hope it helps some of you out. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss the next video. Bye!